Okay, welcome to week two. Uh, first day, Monday, we're gonna do something a little bit different today. Very simple today, three exercises only. Uh, we're gonna do them in what we call a ladder form. So we're gonna start from a low number of reps, gonna work our way up. I'll explain along the way uh, whether you wanna go up to, we're gonna go up to 10 reps. If you're a beginner starting out on some of these or you don't have enough time, you can maybe stop at six. So we're gonna work our way up the ladder, one, two, three, four, five, six, up to 10, and then back down again. Uh, the total number of reps you get through based on the maximum you reach will appear somewhere here, if I've done it properly. Um, so I'm gonna walk you through the first three. Uh, we're gonna do a set, stand up, have a nice big deep breath, go through the next set, next time have two big deep breaths, and you'll follow that pattern all the way up to your chosen maximum number. I'm gonna be working through up to 10, and back down to one, That'll get us through 100 of each exercise. So we're gonna do squats, push-ups, sit-ups. Nice basic exercises. Reminder with our squats, we're looking to sit back, knees staying back behind the toes, coming down to that 90 degrees, hands are out front to keep the back nice and straight, standing up through the heels. So you should be able to wiggle your toes as you come up. Push-ups, <coughs> hands are under your chest, not under your head, so under the shoulders, under your chest, coming all the way down, all the way back up. If you can't come up on your toes, try and lower on those toes, all the way down, lower the knees, push back up. Sit-ups are just till our wrists come over our knees. So coming up to here, back down, so head and top of your shoulders stay off the ground, staying engaged through here, up to there. So that's our three simple exercises. Uh, so I'll walk you through from one to three, we'll speed it up a little bit through the middle, uh, and then, as I said before, we can uh, stop at six, seven, eight, nine, or all the way up to 10, uh, if you feel keen. So here we go. So our first one, one squat, one push up, roll straight over, one sit up, standing up, nice big deep breath, really feel, feel that diaphragm. Breathe out, then we go into our two. So two squats, two push-ups. Rolling over. This time, two big deep breaths. And into our three. Then three deep breaths. So then we keep working through all the way up to 10 if you can, stop a bit earlier if you need to, work your way all the way back down to one. That's all there is for today. So I'm gonna go through the rest now up to 10, speed this little center section up, and I'll give you a bit of a stretch down at the end.
10 for those of you who've been coming along for the journey. So here, nice 10 deep, slow breaths. This round is not about speed, it's about form. It's about recovering. The breathing is actually a really important part of it. So when you get to this bit, really slow that heart rate down. It's all downhill from here. Less exercises every time. Starting with nine, we'll work our way all the way back to one. Then we're done. up to 10 and back, you've done 100 sit-ups, 100 push-ups, 100 squats. I don't know about you, but certainly if someone said to me, go and do 100 sit-ups, 100 push-ups, 100 squats, I would struggle, but when you do it that way, you get a nice big deep breath, really calm the body down, you find you can really focus on that form. Things get better and better as you come back down the ladder again, heading towards one. So you find you can actually push on a lot further, get through a lot more reps, Get a lot more overall benefit by doing that rather than struggling to just keep pumping them out one after the other. So hope you enjoyed that one. Wake, to, wake everything up for a Monday. Wake it up for a Monday if you like. Uh, make sure you stretch down after that. So arms particularly, so these ones across the chest, keeping that shoulder away from the chin, thumb pointing down. None of those things back here. Big leap, for those of you who know about levers, the further out you are, the bigger stretch, more power you can get. So when you're doing this arm stretch, shoulder stretch, Come right out near the wrist, pull across, keeping that chin away from the shoulder. Same on the other side, all of these stretches hold for 20, 30 seconds. Uh, make sure you go into your, uh, these stretches through, through your hip flexors, uh, your, squad your squad stretches, <laughs> stretch through your quads, uh, anything else that's feeling a bit tight, work your way through those stretches. Cool it down, have a nice drink, and get back into your day. See you again tomorrow.